Working in downtown Detroit for 25 years, I've often wondered what causes the steam to rise up out of the manhole covers in the streets. I didn't put a lot of thought into it, but I did wonder. I kind of thought it was sewage and dirty, and I figured it would be smelly. I could not have been more wrong. It turns out that it's something called a district energy network that sends superheated steam through a series of over 50 miles of pipes underneath the streets of downtown Detroit. The steam travels through those pipes to over a hundred different buildings to provide cost-effective heating, hot water production, and something called absorption cooling services to help cool the buildings in the summer months. It's similar to how buildings receive electricity from a utility grid instead of having their own generators. While the steam is supposed to be totally contained in the underground system, the water vapor you see at street level is caused by groundwater coming into contact with the hot steam pipes. That plus occasional leaks. The system is over 100 years old after all. Having been sprayed by and covered in the hot steam, I can say that it has almost no smell, at least in the areas I shot. It is pretty warm though and it causes the ground around the manhole covers to heat up, too. I almost burned my butt on the concrete around where the steam comes out. I'm sure in the winter it makes it more comfortable, but in the summer it's not a nice place to sit. While I'm sure the whole steam system was created solely for practical reasons, it's had an unintentional side effect. It's created something beautiful. There's a magical quality to the steam that's coming out of the ground. I think it adds a natural beauty to an area that is pretty sterile. And since it's not dangerous or bad for the environment, I think that's pretty cool. <laughs>